Hello everyone, my name is Mitchell Sandage, my partner is Tara McKenzie and Johnny Delgado, and this is Progeny. Now although you might not remember much from your childhood, one thing that you could never forget is crawling into bed and drifting to sleep as your parents read you your favorite bedtime story. Now I know every parent and grandparent would love to be there for the children and read them their favorite stories every night. However, whether it be work, the military, or the recent coronavirus pandemic, it can feel almost impossible to spend that valuable time with your children. So we created this site to help solve this problem. Progeny gives distanced family members an easy way to create and share bedtime stories from anywhere in the world. Now this is our landing page, and I'm going to log in to a pre-registered user to demonstrate other functionality. Our website uses Spring Security and password hashing to create secure users that save directly to our database that I helped design. Now I'm gonna pass it on to Johnny. Johnny? Thank you, Mitchell. My name is Johnny Delgado, and this is my Progeny profile page. Once in my profile page, I can view a list of all my recordings, as well as my friends' recordings, and also view a list of all my friends. Also on my profile page, I can add a new recording onto my page by clicking the Add Recording button. Once I click it, it takes me to this Progeny library where I can view a list of all our stories. One of my major contributions was creating the stories and uploading them onto our page using, using Pub HTML5 and embedding the stories in iframes. Today I will be reading from Mother Goose. Once here, I can read a uh, brief summary of the story as well as read through it to see if I like it. Once I decide to read the story and record it, I can go to the Create Recording for this book button. Once that button is clicked, it takes me here to this page where I can now read through the story as I record. Once I get to the correct page, I can begin my recording process and begin the recording by clicking the record button. Little Jack Horner sat in the corner eating of Christmas pie. He put it in his thumb and put out a plum and said, what a good boy am I. Once I'm done recording, I can push the playback button to listen to it. Little Jack Horner sat in the corner eating of Christmas pie. He put it in his thumb and put out a plum and said, what a good boy am I. Once I'm satisfied with the recording, I'll download it and then navigate to the upload page. Here, I can give it a, a title. I'll title it A New Progeny Story. And I can upload it using our file stack API to retrieve the recording from our local storage. Once uploaded, I can go ahead, I'm going to go and save the recording and that will navigate me back to my profile page. Whereas you can see, my story is now here for my friends and family to listen to. Another contribution I made to this site was the admin role, which Taryn McKenzie will now demonstrate. Take it away, Taryn. Thank you, Johnny. Hello, everyone. My name is Taryn McKenzie, and I helped design the user interface for the Progeny website. This included using Bootstrap, CSS, and a little bit of custom illustration for the home page. I also helped develop the Add Friends feature for the website. But for right now, I'm going to demonstrate the admin role that Johnny created. I have already logged into my admin profile. As you can see in the nav bar, we have a drop down. We're able to edit users and also create stories. These are the stories that you see in the Progeny library. Another feature that I would like to share with you is the add friends feature. Here I can view a list of my friends. If I click edit friends, I'm able to view a list of my friends, but I can also delete them. Let's go ahead and search for Johnny. Here's Johnny. Let's add him. Johnny is now our friend. If I navigate back to my profile page, I can see that Johnny is in my friends list, and I can also listen to the stories that he has created. Let's listen to one. Little Jack Horner sat in the corner eating of Christmas pie. He put in his thumb and pulled out a all right, we got his recording. This concludes our presentation. Again, my name is Taryn McKenzie, and together with Johnny Delgado and Mitchell Sandage, we created Progeny, a site that connects users through story time. If you would like to get a hold of us, our links to the alumni, uh, CodeUp alumni portal, our LinkedIn account and GitHub account are on our About page.
Thank you.